In about eight hours, we could see the largest strike in healthcare history. Thousands of Kaiser Permanente employees are preparing to hit the picket lines at every location in the Denver Metro. Denver 7's Colette Bordelon spoke with the union tonight about their demands. A summer of strikes. We're in a crisis in the United States. The economy is not meeting the wages that you want to pay people. Could spill over into the fall. It's almost like having your oxygen turned all the way down and you're gasping for air and you're in a space right now where you're saying, help us, and you're walking away. That's how I feel. Patricia Johnson Gibson. Everyone calls me Pat. Is the vice president of the health care division for the union that represents thousands of workers at Kaiser Permanente. Around 3,000 are in Colorado. I just want Kaiser to do the right thing. She and the rest of the union are ready to strike starting Wednesday morning for three days. Yeah, short staffing is one of the biggest issues. To hire more people, she says the company needs to have better pay. Kaiser Permanente was a place where people were excited to come and work at. It's not like that anymore. Ultimately saying more staff means better patient care. I think it's unsatisfactory for patients to have to wait long wait times to get in to see a provider. It's always been about the patients and we've asked Kaiser, please don't make us do this. We don't we, we don't want to go out on strike. The medical offices and urgent cares will stay open during the potential strike. We're not standing in the way of any patient care at all. In a statement, Kaiser Permanente says in part, burnout is at a record high across the healthcare industry and every provider faces staffing shortages. The statement continues to say a strike is not justified and that the company leads in total compensation in every market where they operate, offers a great benefits package, and that they will absolutely do the right thing for their employees. Folks are just not doing this for the heck of it all, but they're doing it to survive. But Johnson Gibson says she and the rest of the union are ready to strike starting 6 a.m. Wednesday. Club Bordelon, Denver 7. The current offer from Kaiser Permanente includes wage increases of 12.5% over four years. It also includes a proposed $21 minimum wage next year in Colorado. That would increase each year of a four-year contract. Negotiations are expected to continue overnight. At this hour, an agreement has not been reached.